All right, all right. Time to get this started. Let's play some of the Outer Worlds. So as soon as the game shows up, there we go. We are aboard, once again, our wonderful ship. The fire... F oh, wait. Uh, the reliable. <laughs> Unreliable. <laughs> Triangulum Colony 2325. Um, yes, so it's an Apex Transport. So we did a little short stream last night. We got about an hour into it. I was going to stream a little longer, but my OBS crashed and I decided, you know what? I'll just take that as a signal. It's time to go to bed, take a break, start the next morning. Well, that break has taken me to the following afternoon. <laughs> but here we are. And um, we almost went to Byzantium last night, but I wanted to save that for the day when I was a little bit more alert. Uh, I have a feeling it's going to be pretty cool. It's supposed to be where all the rich people live. I was cleaning up a few little side quests before that. So let's go see how the crew's doing. Say hi to them. And then we'll go ahead on with it. We Last night we did get the uh, little cleaning unit going. What's his name? I forget. And everybody's just sitting around. There we go. Sam. The Sam unit. Busy cleaning. He's got lots of corrosive chemicals he can shoot at people now. So we were going out last night with uh, him and Felix because I hadn't gone out with either one of them yet. So we'll continue that for a moment. I did a lot of upgrading yesterday, uh, as much as I could afford. Oh, and we got a new weapon. We got, let me see, these we want to sell or break down, um, but that one right there, that fancy one. So we went to Auntie Cleo's. And the scientist there gave us um, this handgun, which is uh, reminiscent of this one, the Force. So this one is Ulti Nature. <laughs> this one is the Ultimatum Force. Uh, this is a very good gun. We did well with this. It needs to get upgraded some more. And this was given to us at a level 11. So it definitely needs to get upgraded some more. Uh, let's spend all the money we have on that right now, tinkering. So there she is. Let's go ahead and tinker her. Starts cheap, 37 bits, 77 bits, 142 bits, 256, 494. This is where we start to get up there, 944, 1734 <laughs> bits. <laughs> I, we may not be able to afford the next one. We got it up to 18. I'm like level 21 right now. So, oh, and uh, it won't allow us to tinker on it anymore. Interesting. Maybe just because we can't afford it? Yeah. All right. Yeah, because we can't afford it. <laughs> we really can't afford it. Okay, um, so we did that. Now that's 405. That's not bad. And that's corrosion, which we didn't have before. So that's pretty cool. The only thing I'm missing in my loadout right now is a um, zap weapon, electro shock one. But I uh, don't know that I really need that right now. I'm, and I'm reluctant to turn one of these into a shock weapon at the moment. So, yeah, um, we'll let that be. I'm going to go ahead and add these to junk. I think we have a shovel saved right now, so we won't necessarily need that. Um, so let's go ahead and put that away. And so far, it hasn't seemed like you need shovels to dig up treasure or whatever, that they're just... Um, why did this come into level 8? All right, we'll go ahead and put the shotgun away. But they're just a melee weapon. Anyway, was, was what I was trying to say there so where's that tactical shotgun go let's put it away because that could be useful whoa that's a little glitchy glitch there we go very minor glitch though we are carrying the euthanasia kit which i want to level up to seems like all my money is going to be going into just tinkering <laughs> all right so we are back on monarch right now and we're going to finish up this Canid's Cradle. No. Yes. 
It's funny how sometimes you hover over them, but they still don't change. So we're going to go find that UDL gunship that crashed right before, um, uh, right at the end, actually, of the main mission where we were here at Devil's Peak in this uh, this uh, broadcast tower. The thing about this one, though, I'm a little worried. We're going to have to choose between the two and we'll lose our reputation for one of the other. All right, so just for funsies, we're gonna take Felix and Sam. Um, I can tell they're not gonna be my favorite companions, but uh, we just wanna give them a chance, give them a shot, and then we'll go back to some of our more charismatic ones. All right, so let's continue and head on. There we get to see everybody's guts. Every time we go somewhere. Okay, so apparently we just gotta go 94 meters that way. That doesn't seem very far. You guys coming? Alrighty. Welcome everybody who's joined. Just inside here? Nope. Takes me around back. Uh, That's the gate. Stuck in something nasty. Fab units are equipped to handle even the toughest of stains. Initiating <laughs> deep burn removal now. Oh, hey, don't point that thing at me. <laughs> All right. For a minute, I was like a little spooked. I was like, who stepped in here? I thought someone had come in into the Discord or something. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, don't print a shoe. And that's just pointing over there. So, if I look at the map. Let's see where we need to go. All the way out here. All right, so the closest is going to be there. Although that's overland. We take the road. Yeah, that's at the end of the road. There. Uh, we could do a little overland. Let's go there. I don't want to walk the whole way. We may have to kill too many things that way, which it won't be hard, but it'll take time. We still will now. All right, so we're going to hike it. Y'all ready? Let's go. Oh, and we got a fight here already. Who's fighting who? We got some Iconoclast Riders. Oh, they're knocking out the Marauders for us already. Job guys. I'll take care of this. Don't you worry. Yeah, we liberated this place already. I thought things could have spawned back, but uh nope, this is their printing press. That they're holding on to. Good on you guys. Alright, we're not gonna go in there right now. We have other trouble to get into. I've upgraded this nice hunting rifle. I've got a hunting rifle, a assault rifle, Let's see, uh, a heavy machine gun that uses light bullets, and oh, we have the shrink ray. I forgot we got the shrink ray last time. <laughs> shrink things for a little bit. Let's see how that works out. We got these guys. I wonder what the range on the shrink ray is. Not that much. All right, so we got to knock these guys out here. We'll just uh, do it the old-fashioned way. I am. Oh, yeah, we like this. All right, that wasn't as effective. Out his kneecaps. There we go. These guys doing all right. Let's check out Sam's ability here. Oh, that's Felix. He always does the drop kick. <laughs> did you see that? It's pretty funny. Where's that body? There it is. Taking all the things. And okay, didn't get a chance to use the shrink ray. 
It looks cool, huh? Oh, and we tried it out yesterday. It just works for a little bit of time, seems like. It does help weaken them a little bit. So we've got some guys here. Let's see, let's take one out. Oh. <laughs> let's take him down. Missed that. All right. Here we go. Get him. Get <laughs> a little bit of time. That's the last of it. All right, you guys clean up. So I've been working hard on keeping these guys uh, with the best armor I can put on them, and the best weapons I can tinker for them. Keep them from dying and trying to get ready for uh, when we do Supernova mo mode as our next playthrough. Taking all the things, this is all the things. Alright, let's get in there. We got the big bad girl up here. She's a little time dilation. She's pretty tough. Okay, you guys, get in there. Drop kick the Manti Queen. And clean her up. <laughs> oh. That's Sam. Don't shoot Sam. No dying, Felix. But can these guys... They can take friendly fire, right? Oh, no. I thought I saw him go down. Now he seems fine. Maybe when we're in battle? No, it doesn't seem like I can hurt them now. All right. All right, there's the ship. You can see it already. <laughs> That's a lot of acid, Sam. Alright, these guys don't seem to have a whole lot for me. Those hides are actually good money, I think. Meat I've been putting in my inhaler. Although I haven't uh, really used the inhaler for quite a bit now. Oh, hi. You're not sleeping. Or are you not dead? Go. Yep. There you are. Still burning. Yeah, I didn't try shooting him in battle, during battle, but uh, just now he was still right after it. Still was not affected by friendly fire. It's good. A little late in the game for me to fi be figuring that out, but... Uh, <laughs> Hello. This guy doesn't always look... Dead enough. Let me kill him. Oh, another one here.
Ooh, he's got a bunch of stuff. Wow. He was full. Okay. All right, there's the ship. Hey, it's a fast travel site now, too. Cool. Doesn't seem like there is any survivors so far. A lot of dead people. Readying for standby mode upon command affirmation. Entering mode now. I'll keep an eye out. Go on ahead, boss. You guys ain't coming with me? Okay. Oh, we need the captain's key. Apparently we have not found yet. There's the targeting module. None of these guys are the captain. I bet we can... Can we unlock it here? Oh, eject Captain Matsu's command key. Got that. Cool. Continue. Uh, let's uh, run diagnostics. Sure. I sound like I know what I'm doing. The Mark IV gunship's operational parameters have exceeded acceptable damage ranges. The cost of any repairs necessary at your nearest UDL uh, repair facility will be averaged amongst the crew. All right, let's view the logs. Error, unable to access central log storage. Only the most recent entries in Captain Matsu's logs are available. That's merciful. CE saying something about spare regulator bypass something something Chiku Shao. I'm turning this thing towards the groundbreaker, firing up engines and retiring. Better to be arrested than to lose power and drift out into space. I just hope this old bird can handle one last trip. Mm, not quite. Not quite. All right, Captain's Log, December 21st, 2354. How in this law forsaken colony is it so impossible? Excuse me, to requisition parts. My chief engineer is barking at me to order yet another damn thing, and I can't even get a response from corporate. So they're definitely having troubles. And number three, another day, another ship lands on Terra One, and we can't shoot him down. That makes I've lost count. What's the point of being out here if we can't get some backup? Okay, so... And then uh, let's look at the uh, start... Uh, Mayday message playback. Hello, my name is Jen. I'm the chief engineer on this gunship, and I'd like to let the record show that our captain is a total fucking hullhead. She says I calmly. Again and again, that without fixing our regulators, spinning up the engines are going to blow through our coils, and we'll go flying off in a completely random direction. Well, here we are. Thinking we'll hit soil in uh, about 30 seconds. This is your chief engineer signing off for what is probably the last time. It's a shame you can't see this middle finger I'm holding up, because I'm doing it as hard as I can. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All right. We can go in here now. Easy enough. And... Okay, that's locked. Weird having everything at an angle like this, but uh, nothing to loot. Oh, there's a person. Or a trooper. Okay, I can't go back there. That was making me a little dizzy. Okay. All right, there. Is the thing we came for. Targeting module. And I can't seem to grab it that way. What's this? There we go. Let's push buttons we don't know anything about. <laughs> Try it again. Supposed to insert the card somewhere. Here we go. Use. And now do this. 
Uh, oh, there. This is the module. Okay. There we go. We got it. The gunship's targeting module. So now we got to either give it to Sanjar or give it to Graham. Um, honestly, I like Sanjar a bit more than Graham. So let's give it to him. Graham, I just did not care for. Even though I'm usually for the rebels and Sanjar is the corporate interest, we're going to blur it up a little bit and go with Sanjar. Because uh, the Iconoclast, the whole thing with Graham and all that, yeah. <laughs> I don't care for care for him anyway. Maybe some of the people in there, but they seemed a bit brainwashed. So it's more of a cult than rebels, really. All right, so let's go to Sanjar over here, Stellar Bay. Go get that done. Anti Cleo. Got a few few little knocks, dings to our reputation with Auntie Cleo last night. I guess I was a little too harsh in the dialogue with those scientists. Really sick of taking orders, Sam? All Sam units have been programmed to obey customer directives. It ain't your fault you've been programmed by the board. Whole colony's been programmed by the board. What's up, Sanjar? If the Iconoclasts reach that ship first, there won't be any chance for a peaceful monarch. I don't suppose you've found the targeting module yet. I've sent patrols, but they're running into trouble with the Iconoclasts. Mm. Could you agree to... I can give it straight to him, but I want to ask this. Could you agree to a truce with the Iconoclasts? They're all mad. And what's more, they left us. I don't see any way for us to work together. Oh, come on, man. You're supposed to be the performance. I've read your review, Sanjar. You can't do this alone. Ugh, not this again. <laughs> Remember what we practiced, sir. Yes. The words in those reviews were very hurtful, but they do not define me. I am a mantipiller, and my will is my cocoon. I can emerge <laughs> and become whatever I wish. Ooh, poetry. Okay. Um... Which one? We're stuck in this dialogue here. The people who wrote your reviews are the same type of people you'll deal with on the board. It's either that or one. You're good with details, but you could use someone who sees the big picture. Yeah, let's do that one. You too? He has a point, sir. And it's not all bad. Supposing you're right, who exactly would you have me work with? The Iconoclasts are not the most compromising sorts. Uh, what about Graham's second in command? Zora. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's an interesting suggestion. Yes, it was. I confess I don't know much about her except that she worked for Rizzo. I'd be willing to consider it. But I need to see her review first. <laughs> Fine. Excellent. Her review would be in the Rizzo offices in Cascadia. Bring it to me. And I'll see if she's qualified. Okay, so this just updated this mission. Um, let's look at that first. Uh, so let's back out of here. And see what got updated. So. I, if I give him the module right now, that'll end this and we'll lose this optional. So we can convince MSI and the Iconoclast to negotiate. So... I got to see her employee review, retrieve it from Cascadia and bring it to him. So where is Cascadia? Region. Do, 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 do. Amber Heights. That must be Cascadia. Over here. So uh, let's get as close as we can. Over here to the forlorn crossroads. Or gunship crash site. Uh, let's go there. And that should put us on the road. It's very convenient this thing crashed at the end of the road. Zora, Graham, 970 meters. Gotta catch the road. 
Where is the road? HR terminal. Heads up, boss. Uh oh. Hello. Get him, Sam. Everyone all right? Lots of bad creatures here. Okay. Here's the road. Ends right there. <laughs> Hello, guys. Doing all right here. We got a bunch of stuff to sell. At this point, we'll mark everything once we get to the vending machines. There's got to be some marauders and things along here. Everybody leaving all their luggage in the middle of the road. Oh, you. You're on, Sam. Trap kicking Felix. <laughs> right into the acid. Oh god. Don't hurt my Sam. That had to hurt. All germs and contaminants have been neutralized. Okay. Oh, look at all that stuff. Uh, we're gonna get heavy pretty soon, I betcha. How is our inventory looking? 167 out of 250. It's gonna be a good loot haul if nothing else. Okay, these guys, let's try to get them from a distance. Oh god. <laughs> Didn't notice this one. <laughs> oh, and this. Shrink ray. <laughs> yeah, I probably should have just put the shrink ray away. It doesn't last very long. Gotta switch weapons pretty fast, too. In order to make use of it. It'd be good for a melee combination. Shrink it and whap it. Alright, we got more. 